These macarons are defeating me one more time. Please help me. <sighs> <laughs> I feel like my Monday mornings are always the same. We had a great weekend. Um, I posted a vlog from Saturday with my husband. Um, and we had... Uh, we had a good time going out to our thrift stores, the St. Vincent de Paul, Building Value, um, all those things. And um, now I am trying to make sure that Gracie eats her food. <laughs> and she does, uh, apparently is not very hungry for breakfast. Um, but uh, I just sitting here waiting on the dogs to eat her food. I have um, designed my week, as you will, um, for baking. I'm going to attempt macaroons one more time. <sighs> I got some, we went to the, um, Cake and Cookie Company of Cincinnati, and I got some, um, pistachio oil. So I'm going to try a pistachio buttercream. Um, fingers crossed that turns out. I've never done it before. And um, I'm hoping to um, blog later on this week, make a video of once the countertops are dry and I can actually put stuff back on them, make a video of uh, how I make the shortbread cookies um, because those are really good. Um, and it's blog worthy now. I've done it a few times, tested a few of them. Um, and I'm hoping to get a blog up today about um, uh, the hummingbird cake that I made last week. Um, I've made it several times and we made a video of it, the process, like a few years back. So I have video footage, you know, not necessarily a fresh will bake for food version, but definitely some video footage. So, um, I'm hoping to blog that and, um, get that out so that my blog is not completely vacant. Um, it's not vacant, but it's definitely not had anything for a while. <laughs> so, anyhow. I like to talk a lot, and I type too much. <laughs> so, I am, um, well, and secondly, I'm kind of avoiding my bike this morning, but um, I've been working on my hummingbird recipe, and I have, have it complete, I believe, ready to blog, but it is 9.41, and I am 10 minutes overdue <coughs> from what I thought it was going to be, and now I have to go get on my bike, and I just, ah, first world problems, for sure, but um, I'm glad that I have the opportunity to do them, so <sighs> we'll see how it shakes out. So, I got all my stuff done that I was hoping to get done before leaving for class, except I've still got to, oh, I just remembered. I've still got to separate my eggs because I'm making macaroons this afternoon or trying, fingers crossed. Um, so, I've got to get those separated before I walk out the door, but the dogs still have to go outside, so I have to put my shoes on. So, I think I've got plenty of time to do that, fingers crossed. <laughs> so, um, this morning, it's Musical Monday, so I um, sang She Used to Be Mine from um, Music. Uh, sorry, the musical Waitress by Sarah Borales, and um, I just wanted to um, sing that because it was um, inspiring to me many, many months ago when I first heard it, um, and um, it's about women and how they feel about themselves and maybe being put into a situation that they don't want to be put into, um, and um, because of the Women's March over the past weekend, I just wanted to make sure that, um, you know, women felt feel supported. They need to feel supported, and... Um, I'm right there with you and thank you so much for marching because you were not only marching for yourself, but you were marching for me as LGBTQA. I'm not all of those things, <laughs> but <laughs> as a part of that community, you were marching for me. And I really appreciate that because um, we are all in this together and that is the dealio, my friend. Um, we are all in this together and we have to make strides to make sure that we do come together as a community and a nation. Um, there are some things that I definitely don't agree with that's happening in the administration. And I think that we have to fight for the things that we know we want and we are, you know, we voted for, etc. Um, but we also do have to come together and I'm trying very hard to um, make sure that I understand why someone uh, would feel the way that they did to, to vote for um, President Trump. Um, he is our president. I admitted it. Um, but, you know, 
we have to make sure that we lead him in the right direction. As Audra McDonald said, um, we are, um, I'm not going to quote, I will paraphrase, but we just elected our temp um, president. Um, we own him and he needs to do what we say. We are the people. And if he really lives up to what he's saying, which is that um, the power is back to the people, which is a very democratic thing, by the way, um, the power is back to the people, then um, he has to live up to that. I mean, we got to make sure that he does live up to that. So um, I'm, I'm really trying to understand from all aspects of life um, because you can't be a liberal and say, you know, you're only as good as I am if you think the way that I do. That's not the way that it works. We have to be together and believe in each other and believe what each other believes um, and understand. Now, that doesn't mean that you can go and write fag on my wall or swastikas you know, places. I'm not tolerating that. I mean, there's a difference. Um, you have to come to the same middle ground as I do. So, why do the French have to be so hard in their recipes? Oh. I have tried so many times to make these macarons, and they have still spread a little. The batter has spread. Um, so help me, I don't know what I'm doing, clearly. <laughs> um, okay, it's been a long ass day, but I did make some pistachio macaroons and half of them did not turn out very well. Still working on them, still working on them. I will not be defeated by the macaroon. Um, but I want to show you the other thing that we got done. If you can see it, here is we got our fireplace installation finished. And it looks like it has always been there. Like, looks like it was from 1913 when the house was built. So that's kind of cool. I have a little bit of touch up paint that we have to do up here. But now that we've got the, um, the heat deflected because of the surround then we can paint that and it will not be harmed so thank you all for watching um make sure that you subscribe and um, follow my instagram so that you can see stuff that i'm doing like daily on instagram and uh there we go bye